ODOT cruiser working along 71 Highway. Copper thieves broke into the main power source at the intersection of 31st Street, cutting the wires there. And here you can see inside the pull box across the street, all the underground wires stripped for copper. At night, this 11-mile stretch of 71 Highway is now dark, including this bridge near a senior center. Some of these seniors around here, that's the first neighborhood store they got, so they may have to walk. And this bridge is, I mean, just totally, you can barely see your hand in front of your face. It's a constant problem. We fix them. The copper's stolen again. We fix them. It's, it's getting, it's very frustrating for us. MoDOT says it spent $2 million in the past three years replacing stolen wire, and it's getting worse. It now suspects thieves are disguising themselves as MoDOT workers. We even had one of our employees spot someone who was dressed up as a utility worker that we're pretty confident was stealing our copper because they were not in a MoDOT vehicle. A real MoDOT crew will usually have a marked vehicle. Workers will be wearing hard hats and vests, but the most telling thing is time of day. Unless it's an emergency, MoDOT crews will not be repairing wires after dark, so report anything suspicious.